Good morning, good morning. From Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. I'm Alan Uckman here at the CME Group with your morning market stir for Monday, March 16th. Friday had some fallout, tested the lows in the S&P, but did bounce back. The weekly loss was 0.9%, so a very reasonable loss considering the volatility in action we saw last week. The close in the S&P futures, 2050 down 14. Dow futures ended up the best of the week, down 0.6%, off 137 points on Friday at 17,729, but off of those lows as well. The Nasdaq suffered the worst, down 2% or a little bit less than 2% on a weekly basis. 4301 was the close, down 22 points on Friday. The story of the week and the day obviously was a dollar. New highs, 100 and 72. 100.72 was the close in the dollar, up 89. The euro currency, 104.84, down 126 points on Friday. Bonds were steady, up three ticks at 159.19. Crude oil had some sharp selling with that dollar strength, down 221 on Friday at 44.85. Ended up losing $4.75 uh, $4.75 per barrel on a weekly basis. And gold down $12 on the week, but stayed steady on Friday at 11.52. So after the unwinding last week in stocks and some recovery, we saw the dollar surge. Where do things stand here on this Monday morning? We're seeing some positive action in stocks. Up a third of a percent right now, 2051 in the June contract, up nine. We're up 68 in the Dow at 17,721, and up 16 in the NASDAQ 100 futures, we're now trading the June contract. June is the front month in our stock indexes. The dollar selling off a little bit after being above 100, still holding strong, but off of its highs. We're seeing the euro currency bounce. It's up 62 points here this morning at 105.46 after getting close or maybe even making some new relative lows. Bonds are up 20 ticks above 160. The yield on the 30 years at 2.67, 2.09 in the highly watched 10-year note. Crude oil testing lows got as low as 43.57, so those are some new new lows in the crude market. Right now we stand down 40 cents at 44.40. Fours are wild, and gold up four dollars at 11.57. So to wrap up the current action with two hours ago before the cash stock market opened, we're up about a third of a percent plus in the stock indexes, up nine in the S&P, up 68 in the Dow, and up 16 in the Nasdaq. I will see you early Tuesday morning for your morning market stir to set up your trading day. Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group, where it all comes back to commodities.